This is a starter solenoid off of a Johnson Avenrude 60 horsepower, which is about it's the same as most other solenoids off the bigger outboards. Um, at the moment it's just clicking, it's not starting the motor. So I'm going to pull it apart and show you how to tidy it up. Um, I won't be able to do this one handed, so I'll sort of do bits and then jump back in where I'm at. I've got to drill out these rivets, there's a rivet on each corner. I've got to drill them out and I can pull this cap off and basically just tidy up what's underneath and then put new rivets back in again and it should be fine. Here we go. Okay, the rivets are drilled out. They were just little brass rivets, one in each corner. There's a spring inside of this that's pushing out, so I was holding it while I was drilling it. Um, I'll open it now so I can let the pressure off that spring. I should have tied it up a little bit there, sorry. That's what's inside. Basically that copper washer is what makes contact between these two copper points. And being that dirty, it's just not making good contact. It's still clicking, so it's still jumping up and hitting those points, but it's just not clean enough to work. It worked maybe one in every 30 <laughs> attempts. So I'll just give it a tidy up, put some new rivets in and reassemble it, it should be fine. Okay, so I chucked a brass wire wheel brush onto my drill and I've buffed up this base so it's nice and shiny. I've also cleaned up the terminals inside of here. I've pulled the spring off just for a minute, just so I could make sure that this was making contact with both the terminals, and it definitely is. They are worn down a bit, but it's still making contact. Um, so I'm confident this is going to work perfectly fine. I'll reassemble it. Um, I've only got aluminium rivets that shouldn't corrode, but they won't last as long as the old brass ones. But I mean, I don't need this to last another 30 years. It's already 30 years old. It should, I don't know, maybe give me five years. But yeah, I'll reassemble it and I'll let you know how it works. So that's it all reassembled. It should work perfectly fine. Those rivets are holding snugly. Sorry, my thumb's on adjusting. But yeah, they're in there, they're fine. And these are the rivets that I've used. If you want to get the same. And I used a 3mm drill bit to drill out the old rivets. Okay, I'll just go refit it and I'll test it out. There it is on the boat. You can see the new rivets on there, so it's not one of the old jobbies. That's an ugly, terrible wiring, but works every time. Hope that helps somebody. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Cheers.